we are at 8th Street Auto on 8th Street in Wisconsin Rapids. Uh, taking a look at what they have for used cars. Hopefully without too much wind noise since I took my uh, wind sock off. I'm trying to uh, limit the uh, overheating of the camera. So Lincoln's always surprised at the uh, price. 62,000 miles, 25,000. Nice, what? A square vehicle protection plan. 2018, must be a Ford Escape. Cloth interior looks nice. I like the uh, touch buttons. I want to stick it on it. I want to stick the wood for it. Chevy Equinox. Yeah. It's like a nice leather interior. 2017. Oh, 13 grand. Seems like the cheapest thing I've seen all day. How many miles does this thing have? 93,000 miles, 2017. I mean, it's a uh, nice shape, nice options. A lot of miles, but I think everything gets a lot of miles now. Uh, what is it? It's a rogue, maybe? Nissan, 16995, 2019. Little sunroof, cloth interior. 66,000 miles. Yeah, Rogue. Not bad. Looks like something sold, got an empty spot. Kia Sorento. EX6. A little larger vehicle. Oh, panoramic sunroof. Light colored leather interior. We'll sale for 20995 <laughs> It just blows my mind. Prices just keep going up. So many thousand miles on the 2019. That must be their uh, uh, vehicle point as they keep looking for stuff at 70,000 miles. Bright red Chevy F 150. Cloth interior, STX package. The 22. <laughs> Isn't that amazing compared to the price of the new ones? You could buy three of these or one new truck. 114,000 miles. Uh, 2018. Oh, it's got the 2.7. I know I've heard good things about that, but I'm just not sure how that uh, 2.7 will do. Now, that must not even be EcoBoost because there's not a badge on this side. I forget what size the EcoBoost are. Chevy Silverado. Light blue running boards. Black leather seats. Little sunroof 2016. Chevys, you can almost tell them just by the grill of what year they are. They always change at something. I can't talk. 116,000 miles. Uh, yeah, 2016. Oh, 5.3. It's like an eight cylinder. God, I don't see rust on it. I see some plastic cab corners, but there are corners there, but that looks, that looks like it's from factory. All right, much better price, but uh, it's an older vehicle than the new ones were, but those new ones are just crazy priced. 2021 Ram, 4x4, 5.7. See, it says 19,000 miles on it. Oh, 36,000? Yeah, that might be then. Give me 5.7. Texas Edition, GMC Sierra. Look at seats. There's always something going by. Oh, there's something going by when you're uh, looking at cars out on the main drag. Silver is nice. Does have a cracked windshield? No hang tag. Just inquire within. Oh, uh, this I've seen when they've got cars on it. I want to say this is one of the turns. One of these. Oh, no, this one doesn't look like it. They used to have a cable on here that turned. 
the success just started. Damn. Oh, maybe. No, that looks like that is a clear mechanism there. A little car spinning on the corner. 2021 Subaru Crosstrack. White. Puff interior, sunroof. Of course, all the uh, Subarus are all wheel drive. Well, except that one VR0 that they're 58,000 miles. 2021, no sale, hang tag. They've got 25,995 on it, which seems to me you, know, you can get a new one for not much more than that. Cross tracks are a uh, pretty good value, comparatively at least. BW, R Line. R Line is, I mean, a nice trim package sometimes. Four motions, so four wheel drive, SEL, so it's a higher trim level. 30 grand they got in here, 34,000 miles in a 2021. Nothing noted on the little sticker. But I do like the R-Line interiors. They have some nice trim. Oh. $28,995. All right. Ford Expedition, $35,995, 2019. Not giving them away. Not even used ones. Got a nice interior. A spin button selector for uh, your gears. 66,000 miles. 3.5 liter. So it would be uh, an eco boost, I believe. But I don't see badging for that. Third row seats. Limited. A little bit of trim. All right, White Tahoe. LTZ, yeah, I think the rims are, uh, I'm sure it's LTZ. All right, black leather interior. Start off. 31995 There's still a few cars out there you can buy brand new for that. Not much though. Just that uh, tracks, yeah, see, just under 70,000 miles. That must be what this dealer likes. 5.3 liter V8. Is that 2018? Oh, that window's tint is so dark. I can't tell if it's 2016 or 2018. All right, we got a Denali with the running boards that flip down when you open the door. Nice vented interior ventilated seats. See, like these front windows, you can just barely see. I put the camera up to to see in a little bit. With that back window, like, oh, you can see a little bit, but the naked eye, I can't see hardly anything in it, but I guess you can see a little bit in the camera if I put it and actually touch the glass. Wow, 47995 Obviously, I bought houses, maybe not obviously, but yeah, I bought houses for less than that. But the only interior is nice. If that works. Too close? With some mileage. Yeah, too close. Price 6.2 V8. A little code on this so you can read the price. But 2021 Yukon Denali. Very nice. If you want to spend that much money and put that much in the tank. Ah, uh, what are these? Nissan. It's not uh, Kicks, maybe? What are these little Nissans? The birds are uh, working overtime here. Huh, looks like a little bit of corrosion or something on that already. Kicks, there we go. 1.6 liter four cylinder. Just seems like my four wheel has got a bigger engine. Uh, cloth interior. I mean, for what it is, it's fine. It's kind of small. I think I'd struggle to uh, find enough room to drive it. But uh, 2021 for 16 grand, yeah, it's probably gonna be small, I guess, in today's market. Uh, this must be a Pilot. 2016 Honda, always liked blue. My first couple of cars were blue. I don't like light colored interiors though, just because they do show marks. There is a sale tag upside down on the floor. 
So we lost. Got a rocket punch. 126,000 miles, 18 grand, 3.5 liter V6. So uh, part of your decision when you're buying cars is how long is it going to last? Uh, this pilot should last a long time, even uh, though it's got some you know, over 100,000 miles. Maybe compared to the next one. It's a good camera on the mirror. I never noticed that before. A little bit of a people hauler. All right, Tahoe. 25 grand for a 2017. Silver, some meaty tires. Yeah, kind of a gray interior, so a little bit lighter interior. Um, let's see if that's easy. Yeah, see, because that's the camera pushed to the glass and you can see inside, but I pretty much can't. 95,000 miles, 2017. The LT. All right, that's everything on that row. We covered these. There's a couple here in the center. Let's look at those. Sahara, 2018. 30 grand. I think we'll all remember when 30 grand would buy you a brand new Jeep. Not so much anymore. Nice interior though. I mean, they probably added some stuff to them. 76,000 miles. Uh, 3.6 V6, a little cheaper, 2016, 24 grand. Looks like LED headlights, Sahara, Wrangler Unlimited. The side wheel window is really dark. Push the camera off, you can still barely see. 92,000 miles, 3.6 liter V6 on a 2016. Ford Explorer must be. Ah, around here the cops drive a lot of explorers. Someone is afraid of driving something that the uh, they use for patrol cars and then everyone's gonna drive super slow in front of me. Uh, 2.3 liter turbo four cylinder. 81,000 miles. Don't see the sticker on this, so I don't see a price. I ah, just remember back back in the day i guess everything's back in the day you remember back when they were putting uh turbos in some of the gms and then they had all these problems with blown motors 